Hey guys, it's Sam for Digital Meat, and in this Cinema 4D quick tip, I want to talk um, about applying a material to multiple objects and replacing materials. So here I've got a scene set up with um, a cloner, and it's got a couple of cubes, and each one of these has got a different uh, material on it. Now you might be in a scenario where you want to make this cloner editable, and when you do, you're going to have a lot of objects in here, all with material tags on them. Okay, so let's just pull this out, and there you go. So <clears throat> what happens if you've done this, you've saved your file, and now you want to replace one of these uh, materials? So for instance, say I want to do uh, replace the blue material with this um, orange one down here. Now what I could do, and this is a very nice way of uh, replacing all the blue materials, is um, hold Alt, select my yellow material and drag it over the blue material until the borders of it go completely orange so not there not here but like this and then let go and you can see that all of uh, the cubes that were blue and all of their corresponding texture tags have now been changed over to this orange material it's been completely replaced by this orange material but the only problem with doing it this way is now this orange material has overridden the blue and the blue is no longer there, it's gone. So let's undo that, because you may be in a scenario where you want to replace this blue material, um, but you don't want to override it, you want to actually keep the original material as well. Well, there's actually an easy way of doing this. So what you'd do is, you'd, um, you'd right click on your blue material, that's the one you want to replace, and you'd go to Select Texture Tags Objects and it selects all of the texture tags within the scene that have that blue material on it. And if you look down to the attribute, attributes here, we can see that it's got 56 elements selected, all, all of the uh, texture tags. And if you look in the material slot in the attributes, it says mat two. Now all we have to do is drag mat three into this slot and it replaces all of our texture tags with that material and we still retain our original blue material. So that's it guys, I just wanted to show you that very quick and hence the name Quick Tip. Don't forget to uh, check out the Digital Meat website at digitalmeat.uk. Uh, if you wanna follow me on social media, there'll be links to Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus in the description. And uh, if you'd like to support Digital Meat on Patreon and uh, get some extra content there, there'll be a link on screen after this. Cheers for listening guys, bye.